Well, I mean, it, I guess it was his fault for going to town. It was his counter pick. But like, wait. Now we got just, Angbad versus uh, Elegant. I just kicking it right oh, off. Oh, wow. Yeah, winner's finals. First thing, I was like, why are we having the same <laughs> the matchup same again? Matchup, yeah. yeah, it's a completely different player. Two different Olimars. Let's see what um, what Angbad can bring to the table that might throw off Elegant a bit. Or will Ang uh, Elegant have a, a bit of warm-up since he just played an Olimar and kind of just walk all over Angbad? We'll see. Elegant's really good with his uh, combos on float. He's like really good, actually. Like when he gets, it's not like just a one hit or two hit stray. Like he'll make like a hit into like 30% or something. Cause he'll get like the soft up airs and then another hit, and usually back air to end it. Which the back air itself is 14%. So if he gets even three hits, that's 30 something. Even just two hits is still like in the high 20s. Right now, um, at least in this matchup, it looks like Elegant ledge jumps every single time. He's not gonna like, get down smash or anything, but yeah. if people can catch on, he's, <laughs> he's gonna get like back aired more, like as we saw in the last set, more consistently uh, back. Yeah, back air or up air. Yeah, and just, so let's see if Angbat has noticed the same uh, the same pattern. Wow! Oh my gosh! His down grab smash like, on the platform. Like his grab didn't even like <coughs> go anywhere. He's like right in his face, and he. I guess the pick wasn't synced in with him, and he was just an end lag for the second hit of that down Yeah, smash. that happens. All of our life. Yeah. <laughs> right now. How do you not get punished? I mean, I guess Allmar doesn't have the best, the fastest out of shield options. See, that's what we were talking. That's what he we were talking him. about. Uh, oh. Side B. Oh, uh, side B. You can't side B if you have a pickman on you, just because you. It'll stop. But he still had a good enough down B mash to uh, make it back. He uh, he's gonna hit. Save that double jump to the very end. Okay, he's got. Ooh, there we go. Got him to the max rage percent and managed to seal out the stock with an S mash. He's got 65% uh, on him right now. This is dangerous. Like Bad yeah. wants to make it back to the stage right now. Good, good tech. Everyone's teching today. Yeah. Uh, it still causes pressure, even though Olimar won't. Olimar can't raw get against by down B, but it puts pressure. It puts him in a scenario where he could get a down air out because he has to up B again, and it's like because there's enough hits on him, you can visually react to how, which direction he's going to. So if you call it down B into dare, is something that a lot of good movies get. Well, I actually thought that down throw down B was going to work because the Pikmin extended it and made it lag more. I thought it was going to outlast the yeah. air dodge, but it's not going to... Yeah, see, That's he's it. in a... No, no. But he's in a position That's where he can it, get yeah. down... Well, he didn't get oh spiked down. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. He might just... Oh, my God. He makes it back after back all of that. Back going to be it, though. Yeah. Maybe? Just to get back thrown. And that's yeah. going to be the first game for Elegant right now. He's going to take a, a sip of his mango juice. I remember telling everyone in the ch in the stream chat that it is not a carton of milk. It's actually mango juice. And you can clearly see it now in the player cam. So there's no more confusion there. Mango juice. That's his power That's his power juice. That's what gets him in the zone. So game two on to Lilac. Yeah, this is a stage I would definitely agree with. Though. Yeah. For all of Marvel versus Luigi, especially. Um, the landings are going to be a lot harder for Luigi because it's three low platforms, so you don't really have a mix up on the height you can land in. And it's just. Um, all Mark can, you know, stay under the platform to force like, more neutral approaches. So even, even when he has center stage, it limits aerial approaches because it's not like Battlefield, right? right. Where the middle platform is at the top. And right now, Angbad has all the control. Yeah, he basically has just an entire an entire layer above him, with the exception of the two gaps in between the platforms. Um, uh, there's also the uh, factor of the stage tilt that could potentially uh, mess up uh, Luigi's recovery more so than Olimar's. He's gonna. Oh, nice. actually, that time the Pikmin delayed actually messed him up because I think he would have got higher and. The position yeah. uh, Elegant would have been wouldn't have got punished by up smash like right there. So now, yeah. That was a hard uh, angle. Is that going to be a regret? Uh, he's down being so much. He's off stage so much. I'm like, has he really not grabbed the edge? But either way, 
Eggbad wasn't in the position to punish. If it was. Okay, down throw into double up airs. I mean, that purple Giant a lot damage, of yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You got some fishing. If once you don't succeed, twice you don't succeed, you just third time you get up smash. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that, that, that poor tilt couldn't have been intentional. I think he, I don't know what he tried to do. Maybe like pivot S smash to get it off, and maybe like backer to get it off. Let's see what he can make happen. Twenty-eight. This is a good lineup. Oh, see, like I'm saying, every time it's like a three-hit combo, it's not like it's basic. Yeah, Ali getting really on point with these uh, combos on Is the that? Uh, yeah, And the Pikmin are really saving the day for Aimbad right now. He's definitely out of down throw, down percent. At least guaranteed. Maybe a 50-50. Uh. Up smash again. Like, like we were talking about, Wylat. It definitely uh, pressures his, yeah. uh, makes Luigi's landings a lot harder. I think that just uh, shaking his head. He looks stressed out. I don't blame him. He always looks that way. He could be winning. He could be winning, and he looks he looks mad. He looks stressed out. That's that's what Angbad's known for. There's a lot I got to learn here. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, you've only been here for two weeks, and you're here for the long haul, so you'll get to know everyone. That'll be fun. Now we got game three. I'm so u not used to commentating best of fives, so this is gonna be fun. All right, he's staying under the platform. Under the yeah, that, that was actually really, really good to note. <laughs> Being under the platforms is extremely good for Olimar. I actually think Olimar wins this matchup if he plays no commitment, because yes. when I revisited MDBA, because I was in Missouri for a while, I lost to Logic twice. And Logic also took a set off boss at a, not Xanadu, but it was another tournament. And Logic also solidly beat ZD. And what Logic said after beating all these Luigi's, and he used to struggle with that magic for a long time, he said, no commitment. Yeah, it makes total sense. Because, like, how's <laughs> Luigi gonna approach other than, like, you know, just hard reads? And he has to do that consistently because yeah. the shield pushback, like. Luigi is a character that loses to, um, just a slow to mobility. other characters that can wall him out. You know, characters like Mega Man. Mega Man's one of Luigi's worst matchups. Yeah, matches. exactly. Uh, Mewtwo's really bad, too. Um, the range on Mewtwo is yeah. really good. So any character with range or long-range projectiles is going to do well against Luigi. Uh, Down throw back air. Keeps him off the stage. We're not going to take the stock too uh, early. I don't know if I... Well, like, I was going to say I don't know if I agree with that down B, but I get like, all my, yeah, Pikmin will just flank with it. He can't really punish it except at the end lag where Luigi shoots his whole body out. And it's kind of hard to put yourself in the position for that because down B is a, mo has a very mobile move, so it's hard to predict where they're... Oh. He's going to make... No, he's not going to make it back. Elegant just chasing him down in the depths. Sending him to oh, the Shadow that, Realm. This input, that was definitely a fair. It's okay. Uh, he still gets it somehow anyway. Yeah, down throw fair uh, into up air. It's a nice amount of percent. Ooh, tries to go for that again. It wouldn't have killed, but it would have put him in a position for like another down B and then Derek. It would have met, wouldn't have been a fun position for Alligator. Yeah. I mean, hang bad. But right now, uh, he's got the stock in. He's down a bit, but it's not too bad as long as... Oh, that was nice, actually. He just, like, dashed and dashed back, like, like made it out of reaction. Unless he was going to do that get up either way. But I feel like he did, but like, he scouted something pretty well. Ooh, he's so scared right now. So far. Wow. Oh, and he takes that up B, but gets up smashed. <coughs> Angbad really, really upset right now. That was amazing coverage by Elegant. Yeah, Pumping his fist as he's drinking his mango juice. <coughs> Kearns. Is this the Take best note. Luigi in SoCal right now? Um, I, I think it's August. Uh huh. Mango nectar, the good <laughs> stuff. Current mango, mango nectar. <laughs> Yo, sponsor me. I'll shout you guys out. Mango. Uh, I would say Elegant is definitely top two Luigi in SoCal. Yeah, I, I know uh, we have Con Con, the other yeah. one, but I saw the yes. most updated PR because I haven't been yeah. here much. I don't know if it's because of inactivity or what it yeah, is. Yeah, Con 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 has been inactive yeah, for half the season. Elegant is above him on yeah. like the current one, but I don't know if it was because of inactivity or anything. It's a little of both. 
Because I know Elegant has beaten him in the Ditto. Yeah, Concon Con Con was only here for like half the season last last season. Was, was he not entering or traveling? He was traveling. Oh, so he wasn't entering yeah. locally. Yeah. Well, he wasn't entering at all. He was just traveling. Oh, he, he wasn't yeah. traveling for Smash. It was like no, yeah, stuff. yeah. He was I mean, just pleasure. That's summer, man. <laughs> exactly. All right. Oh. Okay. That is what we call getting red. <laughs> the Eptil like set up for the for the position. Wow, how is he not dead? The yeah. Eptil set up for that position and then he like dashed back and okay. Bruh. Down here to up beach. There's no way that's not there's no way that's not intentional. Either. Yeah, no. I at first I thought the first time, but after seeing it like two games in a row, that's definitely intentional. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> Man, okay. So Elegant right now in a really, really favorable position for himself. Up 2-1 in this set. This could be the end from oh what we've seen. Yeah, that was it. Two stock. 3-1 for Elegant. All I gotta say is, including myself, MDVA needs to stop complaining. Like, Luigi mains, we need to stop complaining about our character not being able to kill. Look at that. That is a quote-unquote hard character to get, Amazing. and he got it so consistently. Elegant saying, that's right, the Mango Nectar did it. But you're so right. I mean, we need to we we need to stop complaining about our character. This character's good. <laughs> yeah. All so right. we're gonna go on a quick commercial, and after that, we're gonna have two brand yeah. new.